welcome back all you Magnum PI fans to The Daily Hero. My name is Sean Barry and this is the number one place to get all your comic book, movie, TV, video game, nerdy news goodness here on the internet. Are you like me and you pay $7.99 a month for the DC Universe exclusive streaming service? Well, I got some bad news. As DC Universe has announced it's canceled its yearly streaming service. Not that the streaming service has been canceled entirely, but just the yearly payment method. You can still pay month to month. But this is a bad sign for anybody who likes the service as is, as more and more shows keep leaving the service. It was announced a year ago that Doom Patrol will be coming exclusively to HBO Max as well. And they just announced Harley Quinn will also be coming to HBO Max. And that Stargirl has been moving to CW for its second season. Now this doesn't mean that the service is dead, as it still provides plenty of comic books, but in terms of exclusive shows, we might only see them on the CW or on HBO Max in the future. Does this bum you out? It bums me out. Guys, let me know what you think down below. Do you remember when I told you that Oscar Isaac was done with Star Wars? Well, guess who also was done with Star Wars? John Boyega. John Boyega recently left a message on an Instagram reply that he is, quote, done with the franchise. Now, that's not a good sign, considering if two-thirds of your trilogy don't like your trilogy. As we, had to, we really haven't heard from Daisy Ridley how she feels in the whole process, but it seems more and more that there's a growing disdain for the current sequel series as much as there are for the prequel series. Now, I, I don't think they were that bad, but I don't think they're that good either. I personally love the John Boyega and, and Oscar Isaac's portrayals in the movies. I just feel like the movies let them down. Now I hope, I hope, I hope, maybe in 10, 15 years, a good writer and director can come in and salvage Finn and Poe as great characters. And God, gosh darn it, make them kiss already. That's all I want to see. So guys, let me know what you think down below. And in final depressing news, the rapper Logic has announced that his upcoming new album will be his last, as he is retiring from rap. But on the good side, he announced an exclusive streaming deal to become a video game streamer on Twitch, worth upwards of seven figures, I'm told. Which is mind-boggling that he could be that good of a rapper, and he can kick my ass in Fortnite that well. Guys, personally, I love his music, and I'm sorry to see him go, but I wish him the best. I hope he does really well. That was my attempt at a rap. I'm not very good at it. So, guys, are you going to watch his Twitch streams? Are you guys really bummed about his music? Let me know down below. That's all the news I have for you today, guys. Uh, if you want to see more of this extremely handsome face, check out Hero Network, as I did a live reaction to all of Xbox's awesome new game announcements. I don't know who they are yet, but I know they're awesome. Uh, you guys, I really can't wait to get my hands on the Xbox Series X and the PS5. Right, other than that, guys, also stay tuned to Hero Network, as we're going to have an exclusive coverage of Comic-Con at home here on the, on the channel on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, every social media you can think of. And speaking of which, follow us on social media at Hero Network TV on all social media platforms. And follow me personally at BigBerry63 only on Instagram because I'm just that cool. Other than that, guys, I will see you tomorrow.